Alright everybody, what is up? It's Thunder. Welcome back and fellas, I've got some earth shattering incredible news for you guys here tonight man season four of the best multiplayer game ever made modern warfare 2019 Ooh, nice quick scope homie nice quick scope what season four is being announced tonight and i don't even know who quick scope man because i've got streamer mode enabled so everybody's name is like a different name with a number next to it no i'm not these aren't bots i'm playing against fellas this is just streamer mode dude streamer mode is pretty cool i guess it keeps people anonymous uh i don't know what do you guys think about streamer mode man i don't really stream that much but all you streamers out there streamer mode any good let me know down in the comment section what do you guys think about this anyway moving right along man so season four fellas got announced finally and i'm gonna put up on the screen when it's dropping fellas check this out man so ashton williams dropped this tweet the season four download is going to be large just like all the other downloads with this game and how broken is season four how broken is modern warfare going to be after this download fellas i mean if any ward and modern warfare have a tradition this year with every single update the game gets broken beyond belief so the season four download is going to be large in order to reduce the overall disk space that modern warfare and warzone take up we're compressing a bunch of assets oh i'm sure nothing will go wrong there no not at all <laughs> once installed the s4 launch will only take up an additional four gigs on consoles for all the new content bro i have a feeling this is going to be a disaster so even though i'm super excited super hyped for season four man oh my god i mean season three just went by so fast it feels like i hardly played it at all <laughs> But season four, man, season four is going to change the game, fellas. Season four is going to be amazing. So let's check out when season four is dropping. Infinity War dropped this tweet. Uh, Intel coming on season four. New Modern Warfare and Warzone content uh, is live tonight, June 10th, 11 p.m. Pacific. So there you go, fellas. It will be out tonight, season four. So let's find out exactly what we're getting with season four, man. Oh, my God. I'm so excited. So hyped for this, fellas, man. Season four. Damn. All right, so let's get right into it, fellas. Let's peel it back layer by layer. So season four, the content we are uh, getting is akimbo melee weapons. Ooh, like the uh, ballistic knife operator mod from Black Ops 4. Oh, man, that's going to make the game amazing, dude. Akimbo melee weapons are awesome. I mean, let's face it. Let's be honest. The melee guys had a real rough shake this year with modern snorefare uh, window warfare i mean it was just you know call of claymore modern window it, it's tough for knifers dude i mean it was so bad these knives only temporarily quit this game i guess he came back smart business move tko well, i guess he came back <laughs> you, know, you know he was looking at his finances and said uh you know what i'll just stick it out you know what i'm saying that definitely a smart move so tko quit modern warfare but then he came back i don't blame him i would too i mean let's be honest you, you, hey just take a look at what's happening to me with the black ops 4 uploads man that's all you need to know <laughs> So akimbo melee weapons, come on in. We've also got the Galil Ace coming back. Uh, wait a minute, the Galil? They're putting the Galil in Modern Warfare? Ooh, nice. You don't even need to slap a silencer on it because uh, there's no red dots on the minimap, dude. So great, you can use the Galil without the silencer, man. The Vector is coming back. Uh, the Vector, an awesome weapon from MW2. And we've even got Captain Price finally making an appearance captain price it took him four seasons the dude who pitched the entire game the dude we saw from the first minute of this game his existence captain price smoking a stogie and now he's finally showing up for season four bravo infinity war that is that is just amazing then we've got oh my goodness kyle garrick gas gas making an appearance oh my and then we've got a mw2 remastered map scrapyard fellas this content is looking amazing i mean who's excited Who's excited? I mean, just if, if they stopped it right here, this would be incredible, man. Oh, my goodness. Subscribe, everybody. Subscribe, man. Modern Warfare 2019, best COD ever made. Oh, subscribe, everybody. Hit that like button. Make sure y'all subscribe. Uh, so, Scrapyard, honestly, dude, one of the best maps in Modern Warfare 2. I think they brought it back for COD Ghosts. I didn't really feel it too much in COD Ghosts. Then again, I didn't really like COD Ghosts multiplayer that much. Uh, but Scrapyard and MW2 was amazing. Where are they going to put the doors, fellas? I know that's the first thing everyone thinks of whenever they bring a remastered map into uh, modern Snorfair. Where are they going to put all the doors? Uh, there's a lot of places to put doors on Scrapyard, fellas. Believe me, I I'm sure Infinity Ward will find a way to mess up that map as well. Uh, I have no hope that Scrapyard will be any good of a map. 
I mean, Hovik Sawmill is pretty good, so you never know. Maybe Scrapyard could be good, though. Stop being so negative, Thunder. Scrapyard could be good. I'm going to give Infinity Ward the benefit of the doubt. I'm sure they won't mess this map up the same way they did Crash, and the same way they did Toxic Backlot, and the same way they did every other remastered map they brought into this game. Have they ever... I mean, look at Shipment for crying out loud. That map is an absolute disaster. Uh, but you never know. Scrapyard could be good. Uh, Juggernaut BR. Juggernaut Battle Royale? Come on in. 200-player Battle Royale. I mean, I just played a Battle Royale this morning. You guys, if you guys missed that gameplay, I will pin it at the top of the comment section. But I just played a Battle Royale this morning, dude. And uh, it only started with like 68 players, dude. So, I mean, I'm <laughs> good luck trying to get 200 players in a Battle Royale game. I can only get 68 players this morning because I didn't have crossplay enabled. I just have playing with other PS4 players. But a lot of people say in the comment section, yo, man, you should have enabled crossplay so you wouldn't have had to wait so long. And so you could have started with a full lobby instead of 68 players. And, and just so you guys know, spoiler alert, I did make it all the way to the top 10 in that video. But I got murked by some Pakistani dude. That, I mean, that's how bad, that's how few people are playing the game, apparently. I had to wait 10 minutes to get into a lobby. And then when I finally got into one, uh, there was only 68 players, and I was playing dudes living in Pakistan. My, my man was, he, my man camping on a skyscraper in Pakistan took me out, but I made it to the top 10. Uh, but you know how it is in that game, man. I mean, camping is one thing, but camping on the ground is like for noobs. You gotta get up on top of the skyscrapers, man. That's the pro camping in Warzone, man. So, next time I play that game, I will definitely be looking to go building to building like Batman. You know what I'm saying? That's the way I'm gonna play uh, Battle Royale next time I get on there. So, I don't know. They say 200 players are gonna be in the Battle Royale mode. I'm probably going to have to turn crossplay on, but I mean, I shouldn't have to. I shouldn't have to turn on crossplay. They just said they had 500, oh no, not 500, 50 million players playing Warzone. Warzone is a free game mode. I shouldn't have to enable crossplay to fill up a lobby in a free game mode, should I? Especially when they said they had 50 million players on there. What are they, all on Xbox and PC? Where's all the players at, dude? <laughs> I shouldn't have to turn crossplay on to fill up a free to play game that's supposedly the most popular game ever made. The most popular game of the console uh, generation here. So then we've got a live event. Have no idea what that is. Anybody know? Drop that down in the comment section. And we've also got Weapon Mastery Challenge and Calling Cards. Finally, dude. Y'all wait till Season 4? Y'all wait till June to put Weapon Mastery Challenge and Calling Cards in the game? This stuff should have came out with the game, dude. But then again, man, how many levels is it to rank up your weapons all the way? They probably figured it would take until June for us to actually be able to unlock this stuff. So we got Weapon Mastery Challenge and Calling Cards. Did they put the Nuke Player card in the game yet? <laughs> they shipped the game without a Nuke Player card. Unbelievable. Uh, we also have, now this is what I'm looking forward to more than anything, the Black Ops reveal, COD 2020. This, to me, the most exciting part of Season 4, and probably, like, honestly, the only thing I'm really looking forward to. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, don't get me wrong, this other stuff sounds cool, too, if you like the game. But, yeah, this other stuff sounds pretty cool, too, I guess. But I'm really looking forward to the COD 2020 reveal. I let me tell you guys something right now. I hope they show multiplayer, dude. I have a feeling they're just going to come out with a snippet of campaign footage, and they're going to announce the game. Listen, man, you guys made us wait till June. I, I mean, I don't even, there is no E3 this year, right? So, I mean, just, just come out and show us the game, bro, at the PS5 event. Show us the multiplayer, man. Everybody knows the campaign's going to be good. I mean, why even bother showing us the campaign? Show us the multiplayer. Show us some zombies. That's what people really want to see. I mean, I know there's a lot of people hyped for, to play the campaign also. And <laughs> the RPG of Justice, baby. Uh, yeah, Mr. Steal Your Care Package. Come on in. Uh, so I know a lot of people are hyped to see the campaign, I guess. But listen, I think more people are nervous and curious to see what the multiplayer looks like. A lot of rumors saying that uh, COD 2020 multiplayer is going to be just like this multiplayer. And like I said, if it is, you're going to be seeing a lot more Warzone gameplay from me. I can promise you guys that right now. Anyway, are you guys hyped for Season 4 of Modern Warfare 2019? If you are, let me feel you in the comment section. Be sure you guys subscribe. Be sure you guys drop a like on the video. Thank you guys all so much for the support. And I'll see you on the next one.